I'm gonna check out a Dual Star Omega blade, which is a lightsaber blade that just has the most LEDs you could ever get in a blade. This has 528 LEDs in this blade. Now it's not a 70 inch long blade, right? The reason why it has so many LEDs is because these strips are super compact and they have the LEDs stacked one on top of another. So we still got our 32, almost 33 inch blade length here, which is a standard blade length, but the LEDs are so dense that it provides the most HD or high definition kind of blade viewing that you've ever seen in a lightsaber. We're going to be able to see our blade effects like better than ever in a dual star Omega. The downside, the downside of a dual star Omega is the LEDs are smaller than in our standard blades and our tri stars and our quad stars and our dual stars. So the dual star Omega has slightly smaller LEDs, which means they're a little less bright, right? So this isn't going to be as bright as a tri star, even though it has more LEDs than a tri star, it has 528 but uh, the LEDs are a bit smaller than our 3.5 millimeter square LEDs. This is the next size down. So let's go ahead and see what this looks like turned on. So I've got a blade style already picked out here, and I don't know if it's gonna show up on camera for you guys, but it's a bluish lightsaber blade with some colors, some lighter colors that actually pulse up the blade. It seems almost like a rising bubble or a rising water type of effect here. Um, when you are this close like I am, I'm not seeing any of the individual LEDs. There is really like perfect diffusion on here. There's multiple layers of diffusion and the blade looks super, super smooth. But what I am seeing are the blade effects as intended, which are these color stripes kind of rising up the blade. So this is a type of blade for people who like to see everything in their blade effects and their blade styles. So let's go ahead and see another blade style Maybe we can find one of the fire blade styles or one of the kind of rainbow blade styles that we could really see the changes up close. Spectrum. Now I'm using a Crystal Focus 10, which has a bunch of blade styles that I'm selecting through, but this blade is a universal blade. The PCB is able to run on any of your NeoPixel sabers except the lightsabers that cannot go up to the limit of this uh, high definition blade, which is 264. So we actually have 264 LEDs on one side and 264 LEDs on the other side for a total of 528. And if your lightsaber cannot go up to 264, as far as an LED count, you will not be able to run this blade. This is for higher end boards like the Crystal Focus and the Profi, which are able to actually go up to that high number of 264. So as I rotate my Crystal Focus lightsaber, I am seeing some different blade effects here. This one is actually one that I can notice pretty well. I hope you can see it on camera, that there are these cloud-like colors of pinks and purples and whites and yellow that are rising up the blade almost in like a, a fire pattern there. This is more of a traditional lightsaber um, blade effect with a flicker and different variations of flicker as I turn to cycle through these blade effects. And I am seeing something inside that effect which I don't think will pick up on camera. So let's keep turning seeing what else is available here. We have our rainbow, which is a smooth transition here. Um, probably a bit smoother than other blades because of the sheer amount of LEDs there. So let's go ahead and stop on that one. So we do have our traditional LED stuffed up into the tip here. So we have a very full 
and smooth tip and our trans white blade allows every single color uh, to be seen as it should. As I do swing this blade, this has a swing bright effect which changes all of the colors to a little bit lighter and a little bit whiter as I swing it. So maybe the camera is picking that up. It looks really cool uh, in the mirror that I do have uh, behind the camera. Um, so I hope that's really come, coming through for you guys so you can see that. But that's one of the effects of the Crystal Focus 10 um, board is that swing bright effect. And it's just really, really cool on this Dual Star Omega with 500 plus LEDs. It is such a smooth transition when these colors shift. This is a great type of blade for any of you out there that are looking to create your own blade styles because this is going to give you the, the real true sense of what you've made when you create your new blade styles.